If you or a loved one suffer from peripheral artery disease, also known as PAD, then the information on this video may help you better understand this condition. It will also provide information on a research study called the PACE trial designed to treat PAD. This research study is being carried out by the Cardiovascular Cell Therapy Research Network, or CCTRN, at seven research centers across the U.S. and is sponsored by the National Institutes of Health. PAD is a disease where the arteries that carry blood down to the leg become narrowed or blocked, resulting in leg pain that is usually relieved with rest. The location of the pain depends upon the location of the blocked artery, with calf pain being the most common. These symptoms are also known as intermittent claudication and are commonly associated with smoking or diabetes. Treatment may improve symptoms and slow or stop PAD progression. The purpose of the PACE trial is to find out if stem cells taken from a person's own bone marrow can be injected into the leg and improve blood flow, thereby decreasing the pain associated with this condition. Special stem cells, called ALDH bright cells, can be found in the bone marrow of adults and may play an important role in repairing tissue. These are the adult stem cells being used in the PACE trial. Stem cells are collected through a procedure called a bone marrow aspiration. During this procedure, the patient is given relaxation medicine and after local anesthesia, a needle is inserted into the hip bone to withdraw about 12 tablespoons of bone marrow. The bone marrow is then sent to a lab and processed. Two or three days later, the patient returns to the clinic for injection of the selected cells into the leg. After anesthetic cream is placed on the leg, 10 shots are given in the calf and lower thigh muscle. The whole injection procedure takes less than an hour. Stem cells may help create new blood vessels, stop cells from dying, or they may transform into other tissue, including new muscle. Stem cells could become a regular treatment for PAD if studies like the PACE trial show good results. The FDA has allowed the research centers of the CCTRN to study these cells to find out if they can improve the blood supply to the leg. Patients are required to come back for follow-up visits four times in the six months after receiving treatment. As with many clinical trials, there is a chance of receiving a placebo, which is a solution that contains no stem cells. Half the participants will receive stem cells and half will receive placebo. It is necessary to give some patients a placebo solution to determine if stem cells are a better treatment for PAD. Patients and doctors will not know who received stem cells or placebo. Therefore, patients who receive a placebo solution will get the same care for their PAD as the patients who get stem cells. All patients will have direct access to the research team for at least six months. Taking part in this research study is voluntary and may or may not help you personally. However, we hope that you will consider participating since it could help others in the future who are living with peripheral artery disease. If you are interested in more information about the PACE trial, go to the CCTRN website at www.cctrn.org.